Are you building a PC and wondering how to install the graphics card or video card on the motherboard in your case? Well, today we'll show you how to install the graphics card in your new PC build. It's really quite easy to do. We're gonna be using the Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3060 that I picked up. And for the case, I've got the Thermaltake V250 and a Gigabyte X570 or a Celite Wi-Fi gaming motherboard. If you are interested in any of these components, I will have links below in the description so you can pick them up for yourself or find more information. Now, if you are new to this channel, my name is Ken. This is Northern Viking Every Day, and we bring you videos on reviews and how-tos. So please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and dive right into installing this graphics card. First things first, go ahead and remove both side panels from your PC case, allowing you to have access to all your PC components. Let's have a quick look at where the graphics card will sit on my motherboard. I have two PCIe slots on my motherboard. Typically you would pick the first one, and for myself, this one has extra metal support. Now the HDMI ports and the display ports on your graphics card will go out the back of your PC, and you need to line up the graphics card here to see which covers you need to remove. I've actually already removed a couple, but go ahead and hold up your graphics card in the correct position so you can see which covers you will need to remove. Now each PC case will be slightly different. Mine has this metal cover here that you can loosen off with a Phillips screwdriver. That'll give you access to the different back panels that you can remove. So some of these on some PC cases will be in there with a screw. Mine are just tabs that you wiggle back and forth and they will pop out. So again, make sure you're taking out the correct ones that align with your video card. The next step, you'll see these little tabs next to the PCIe slot. Make sure these are pushed down just like that. You don't want them in the up position. Again, you want them in the down position just like that. So go ahead and line up the PCIe slot with the connectors on the graphics card and hold the graphics card by the edges. You don't want to dab in your fan or anything when you're installing this. Line it up perfectly and give it a quick push and it should snap right into place. So you'll notice there's still some wiggle to the graphics card. You're going to want to put a screw here to hold the graphics card in place. My PC case did come with some screws and the one I needed to hold the graphics card firmly in place. Go ahead and screw that in. And once you've done that, if you do have any other covers like I do, you can go ahead and install those here as well. Let's have a quick look at the wiring for our graphics card. I have a 6 plus 2 PCIe connector with my power supply unit. Mine is modular, so I'll just plug it in as I go. Yours might be already attached. Once you find that cable, go ahead and feed it through in the most convenient location that lines up with the connector on your graphics card. This will be slightly different for each PC case. Go ahead and grab the cable on the other side. You can see my PCIe cable has two connectors on it. We only need one. And my graphics card here, you can see it is an eight pin graphics card. So we're gonna use the six plus two. Some graphics cards only have six pins where you would only use the six pin portion. Now let's go ahead and plug in the two pins first here on the side. Just make sure you're putting them in in the correct direction and then we'll put in the six pins just like that. They should snap right into place and you can cable manage your cables as you see fit to make it look nice and neat. And really the last step is when you start up your computer, make sure you go download the current drivers and install them so everything runs perfectly on your PC and you are all done installing your graphics card. So hope this video was able to help you install your graphics card in your PC. If it did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media. You will find all those links below in the description. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.